if everyone please listen up and calm the f down. May I have your attention? I mean, I, I thought the movie was just okay. I, I don't see the big deal. So heaven help me, Electro. If you disrupt this conference, I will launch a rocket at your ass, leaving a crater bigger than Amazing Spider-Man 2. I was just saying, why did Steve Trevor have to die? It just didn't make any sense. Now, you have seen how bad things could get and how quick they could get that way. Well, they could get a whole lot worse. So we're not gonna fight anymore. Denobi 2 will indeed do Bison Wonder Woman. Do you feel in charge? Denobi 2 can tell the difference between saving the hot toys and destroying it. Look, anger and frustration will get us nowhere. He is already aware that the head scope looks like Mini Driver after a long night of drinking. Nick, that was uncalled for. Mini Driver is a talented actress. By the way, your Twitter account was hacked. What? I, I, I did that. God damn it! I hate this hacker crap! There's something very familiar about all of this. World War One, World War Two. Save the country from an evil dictator. Lose your love interest in an act of heroism. Oh, shut up, Captain. No one cares about your first Avenger bullshit. We all sat through that mess to get to the sequels. I still have Bucky. <laughs> Look, the list of complaints coming in are being addressed accordingly. Bad scope, glossy skin tone, limited articulation, you folks know what this is, right? Ugh. Current line of Hasbro Marvel Legends characters. Hey, I resent that comment. I'll have you know that I am hip and cool with all the millennials. Keep your arrow tucked in your satchel, Miss Katniss Everdeen. What this means is a fights and build using fights and technology to see if we could come up with something better. Hulk says the idea sounds fabulous. Wouldn't have been my first call, but down in the real world, we're faced with ugly choices. I'll let Denobi 2 know that we're ready for the unboxing. Which generation body is he going to use? How the hell should I know? Denobi 2 makes shit up as he goes along. I'm Batman. We're doomed. Oh yeah, no one's looking. This is definitely my chance. Do you know who I am? You franchise ruining glow bug. When I tell you to. All right, Hot Toys Wonder Woman. Finally, been dying to get my hands on this. Look at this. All right, generic box, nothing fancy. Uh, Batman v Superman, Wonder Woman. Let's open this. Uh, let's open this up and see what we have here. All right. So far, so good. Okay. Decent amount of accessories. I'll, I'll give him props and credits for that. Got shields, some leather straps, tons of hands. You can see magic la golden lasso, sword. Let's take a look. Yeah. What? What is? Okay. What? What's this? What? What? No. Look at her. No, her skin tone's way too dark. She is one shade away from passing off as Zoe Saldana. That's too dark. It's way too dark. And I'll I'll squint my eyes and pretend that that sculpt looks like Gal Gadot. That's not Gal Gadot. <laughs> What's this now? So it's an action figure, but you can't articulate it to a point. I guess I'm gonna I, I'm gonna be honest with you. This thing is really rigid. This is really rigid plastic i wouldn't even call this rubber at least rubber you can bend this is more of a vulcanized plastic maybe yeah this is interesting this is a very interesting direction that hot toys decided to go with this figure i i, I don't know what to do here you sure about this they will hate on you are you prepared for that oh of course they will you know the wrong skin tone it looks off Long neck, etc. But I'm gonna tell you something. I'm gonna I'm gonna make an effort here because this is just ridiculous. Your options for the build are presented in these Fison bodies. Which one will you use? So I think the biggest challenge in prepping for this video was trying to figure out what Fison body, what generation body is at least somewhat suitable to replace the Hot Toys body. 
I wasn't really so much going for the skin tone. I honestly, from the very beginning, thought the skin tone was too dark. I was more concerned on what body would be able to fill the costume uh, a lot more better and have a more humanistic skin tone. Because uh, again, I think this the spray tan color variant that they used on her, I, I think it's just wrong. I don't think Gal Gadot is, is this dark. Uh, again, that's my opinion. People can beg and differ, but uh, what I decided on was this tanned version of the seventh generation medium uh, size body. This was the same body that I used for Harley in the last video, and I think it's gonna do the job. I, I really do. It seems to have the hip, it seems to have the, 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 the chest size to actually do it. Now, before I start dismantling this body, let's let's talk about this so-called uh, technology that Hot Toys use, this ratchet system. This doesn't feel like true rubber. This is more of a hardened plastic. Uh, in fact, most of you are probably already uh, used to this hardened plastic in, in dolls. In fact, it's very similar to what you would encounter in an old Barbie doll. It's that plastic hard you know, system that is used to ratchet the leg. Uh, after a while, it, it will break. Not saying that you're going to ratchet her leg multiple times, but that's what it is if you're trying to get an idea of what this is. This is not silicone. I wouldn't even call this true rubber. This is more of a hardened plastic with a plastic ratchet system. It, it really is. It's also difficult to maneuver. What the heck is wrong with this body? Does it have rheumatoid arthritis? Overall, not a bad figure, but I felt they dropped the ball on certain issues. I think it could still be saved. It's about what you believe, and I believe in love. Only love will truly save the world. That's cute. I'll go ahead and frame that for you. Huh? What? I will fight for those who cannot fight for themselves. What? What did she say? I thought she could speak multiple languages. Apparently, English isn't one of them. Knock it off, you two. I'm here to complete a Fison build using your accessories, if you don't mind. I cannot stand by while innocent lives are lost. Oh boy, we got a live one here. All right, let's start. <laughs> So let's start to dismantle. Luckily for me, it's not going to be that difficult because this figure is built like a Mattel product. Uh, what that means is it's easy to, to disassemble. Everything is, is very loose, uh, pops right off. No, uh, no challenges so far. Pop in the, uh, the boots and you can see the peg there. I'm going to encounter a little bit of a issue later on. But everything just slips right off, which makes it easy. Makes makes the uh, the Fison transfer so much more easy. Now the body, I did some research online, and I know it's it's a two piece. Uh, the thighs are ball socket joints, so they can just pop right off. Very easy. And then you have to slowly tug on the upper chest because it's three part, well, yeah, it's, it's two parts or three. It's the top, which is the, uh, I'm gonna call it the hybrid plastic mold there with the center waist. And Again, this top part is so confusing. It looks like it would have all points of articulation and it, it doesn't, it's so rigid. Let's pop the uh, bottom torso. And what I have here in my hand is, this is Wonder Woman, this is it, this is the, one piece suit it's it's molded plastic and uh i guess that's her panty i'm not sure what that is but yeah this is such a unique design i can see where they were trying to go with this i can see where they were trying to create some sort of hybrid seamless figure here which it may probably have looked good on paper but when it gets down to it uh, again it just doesn't make any sense as to why it's so hard to articulate why it's so hard to to rigid um yeah, I honestly don't know what I'm going to do with this. I'll, I'll take care of that later. Again, this is the seventh generation body. I think it's just a little bit too small, but I, I think it's going to work. I really do think it's going to work. And uh, to, to pull off this transfer, because uh, it is a one-piece suit, and I do have to kind of get it in there. I can't break the uh, the actual Fison body. I'm going to use uh, tape here, boxing tape there, and 
you're, you're gonna make sure that that the glue on the tape is, is worn down uh, it's gonna make it so much easier to pull off and remove and it, uh, squeezing the actual figure through the one-piece suit uh, works everything else pops right on I, I don't see any I didn't run into any challenges other than the actual shoes right here I had to do some drilling I didn't show you guys drilling, but I did have to drill and get the ball sockets to kind of fit properly in there uh, I don't know if that was their intention to avoid it or, or their design but uh, I, that was probably the uh, the hardest part about this build I'm going to keep the Fison hands that came with the body and avoid using the the wrist gloves us uh, simply just to match the skin tone I, I'm going for a lighter skin skin tone here I'm not going for that Jersey spray tan look so I'm gonna avoid the hands the wrist guards slip right in they, they fit just right just perfect and uh, so far it's 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 working out I mean it's starting to look really good uh, if your skin tone looks a little bit bleached it's because of the lights but uh, what what this is here this is the hot toys head uh, obviously this is not gonna work the skin tone is clashing luckily I was a little bit proactive and I found a, a third-party uh, head here that has a, a lighter skin tone which will blend a little bit better there you go let's get it going with the truth is more difficult than you think. I learned this the hard way a long, long time ago. And now my life will never be the same. Regarding my new body, it's hot. Whatever. <laughs> Didn't know me too here. Uh, folks, thanks for watching. Thanks for taking the time to enjoy the video. Uh, like, subscribe, leave your comments below. And if you have some more time, check out some of my other videos on my channel. See ya. Well, that was fun. Now, what do I do with this thing? Huh. You know what? I have the perfect spot for it. I got it.